Hi, my name is Kevin, and I'm an American from Chicago, Illinois. But right now, I'm not in Chicago, Illinois. Actually, I'm in Germany. I just moved here about three or four months ago, and I'm really loving it. It's a great experience, and I plan on staying here for quite some time. But let me tell you a little bit about myself. Um, I'm an English teacher, and I first started teaching English back in 2002 in Bangkok, Thailand. What a cool, awesome place to teach English. Um, I taught there for about five years, and then I moved on to Tokyo, Japan, where I taught English for about 10 years. Now, during this time, I taught all different levels of English from beginner to intermediate to advanced. I taught businessmen, uh, children, middle school students, housewives, uh, retired people, you name it. But I must admit something. When I first started teaching English, I wasn't a very good teacher. Um, my students were not improving. Their level was like this, straight. They were not improving at all even though they were learning English from me once or twice a week. And it was a terrible feeling. But I wanted to be the best teacher that I could be. So I asked my fellow teachers, my colleagues, the best ways to teach English. And I watched them. I read a lot of books they recommended. I searched all over the internet. I went to courses, I did trainings, and over that time, I picked out the very best methods and tried them on my students. And the results were amazing. My students learned automatically. They learned to speak English with confidence. Okay? Their pronunciation improved. They made less mistakes with grammar. Um, they got jobs that they wanted. Um, they made friends from all over the world, and it was really incredible. The students were really happy, and finally, I felt very good being an English teacher. And I continued teaching after I discovered these amazing techniques. And I'm still teaching today because I really am excited um, about actually using the internet, using Verbling, to meet students from all over the world and exchange cultures, exchange uh, languages, uh, cuisines, food, um, and many things like that. Because when I taught in Bangkok or Tokyo, I was just teaching Japanese every day or Thais every day. And that was wonderful. But I always dreamed about having students from each day from all over the world, from different backgrounds and different languages. That's always been my dream to teach. And that's why I'm here on Verbling, to find these kinds of students. And also to introduce my unique method of teaching that you will be amazed about. So let me ask you a question. Do you often feel shy or frustrated or nervous when you speak English? Mm -hmm. Do you uh, make mistakes, like grammar mistakes, when you speak English, even though you learned grammar for many, many years? Yeah. And how about your pronunciation? Do sometimes people um, not are not able to understand you sometimes? Yeah. Well, that's okay. That's very normal, actually. And we can fix those problems. Um, you're not alone. Actually, there are millions of people like that. Um, and the reason is not because of you. Um, it's because of the methods that you use to learn English. Uh, those methods are very old, very outdated, very traditional methods used in school. Um, those methods tend to not work very well because they're very boring. Okay? Now, my methods are not like that. They're new, based on scientific research, and very unique, and very fun, interesting, and exciting. So, to find out more, I want you to book a time with me, 
Um, my schedule right now is very flexible. Um, so I'm available most days, most times, as, as I just moved to Germany. And try it. Uh, try a lesson with me. There's no risk, right? So why not just try? Um, so send me a message through Verbling, and I will get back to you, and we can get started on improving your English and um, getting you to the point where you sound like a native speaker with confidence. Okay, that's the goal. All right? So it was nice talking to you. Thanks for listening. Have a great day, and Goodbye. See you later, alligator.